Now, it's our top story at 5 o'clock. A pit bull breeder is savagely mauled to death by the very dogs he was raising in Compton. His mutilated body was found inside a blood-stained kennel on his property. KTLA's Chris Wolf joins us live from Downey with details about the gruesome discovery. Chris? Yeah, share and court gruesome discovery indeed. Veterinarians here at the LA County Animal Control Center in Downey have been working with these pit bulls. We understand they have been sent out for DNA testing. Authorities believe the victim was actually killed sometime last night, maybe around 7.30, 8 p.m. And his body was in that dog pen for hours until his girlfriend found him this morning. Sky 5 was overhead as a woman frantically scales a fence, trying desperately to avoid some very agitated and apparently dangerous dogs on the ground below her. They have already killed her boyfriend, whose ravaged body is just feet away. The deadly pit bull attack happened at a home on North Thorson Avenue in Compton. Investigators say the woman discovered the gruesome scene Friday morning in the backyard and called 911. There is surveillance footage of the incident uh, or, or, you know, surrounding the property. And it was discovered that as uh, our victim was in the backyard, apparently feeding them, it sounds like they attacked him and ultimately uh, he succumbed to his injuries. Law enforcement personnel, firefighters and L.A. County animal control officers quickly converged at the location. First responders say the initial challenge was to corral the dogs into a neighboring yard to gain access to the victim. The graphic footage, which we will not be revealing, shows the dogs ripped off most of the 35-year-old man's clothes in addition to fatally biting and mauling him, neighbors and animal advocates are stunned. People need to take better care of their dogs. People need to understand that um, these dogs can kill somebody and hurt people. It should have never happened. This time it happened to the owner of the dogs, but normally it happens to children, elderly, defenseless people, and somebody definitely needs to be held accountable for this. There has to be some kind of law and order here. Animal control officers removed 13 pit bulls from the property, male and female, five adults, eight puppies. Investigators are collecting DNA swabs and forensic evidence, trying to determine which dogs actually attacked and killed the victim. Experts will be examining the dog's general health and behavior and aggression. If any animal is determined to be unsafe for human interaction, it will be euthanized. And one man who does a lot of plumbing work in that neighborhood tells us that he has seen some pit bulls running loose in the streets and that, quote, they are not to be messed with. Reporting live in Downey, Chris Wolf, KTLA 5 News. Chris, thank you.